this is it's me it's the thrill the thrill thrill whatever you want to call me um starting out on this new game tiny mighty <laughs> i sound a little exasperated right now i tried recording uh, something recorded for like 20 friggin minutes and then something wrong with my sound so can't upload that and now i can't record the thing again that i wanted to record so uh, sorry about that you guys but anyway hopefully i can still get my point across i'll try to record it again um, i can't go into as much detail as i could before you'll see why in a minute but basically i wanted to talk about heroes how to um, recruit them how to upgrade them so we'll start out with the basics of it uh, to recruit your heroes uh, if you're just starting out this game or if you haven't started out this game you start out with one hero you start out with this dude and then as you go along um, you very quickly get the archer and then you get whatever their version of Black Widow is called you would get Black Widow um, so you basically get three to start out for free and then you have to uh, try to recruit some later on um, you get this electro dude he's pretty strong he's actually one of the better ones um, but you get him um, just from completing uh, some quests and stuff so you end up getting him for free as well so some of this stuff comes along pretty pretty easily some of these others cost a little bit more take a little bit of time um, if you're a completely free player, I'm not going to lie to you, it's going to take you some time to get some heroes. If you cash a little bit, and I do mean just a little bit, you can get heroes a lot faster. Um, but anyway, so you start out with the basics, and if you want to end up getting more, I don't remember what level this unlocks, but relatively quickly this tavern unlocks, and this is where you recruit your heroes. Um, well, just a second, let's go back to here and to explain something. When you create if you haven't created a character on here yet um, the fights in here and stuff you yourself are not actually fighting so this is just an avatar basically you you represent the team leader and your job is to put together a team of heroes um, the best you know team you can and the more heroes you have the better off it is there are different scenarios in here where just having one good party is not going to be, be everything you do have to change out your heroes for different things um, some uh, fights are completely immune to magic attack some fights are completely immune to physical attack so you do have to change out your heroes for certain things um, depending on the situation so anyway I've got my myself and this is just a skin just an avatar just to represent myself as the team leader um, the heroes that I've unlocked so far that I can choose pick and choose are here and when you go into a fight you can pick up to five heroes um, at a time so yeah anyway so back to the tavern you can see all the complete list of heroes that are available different heroes of course have different skills different talents different traits stats whatever you want to call them um, here's what they list each skill each one and this is really what you're looking for is the cost to summon them or recruit them is these modified genes that's just for this one different ones mutant gene these ones uh, basically if you look up here here's what I have so far this is what it'll cost for some of the weaker heroes a little bit stronger a little bit stronger the strongest hero so this hero is obviously one of the best um, her, you can see her talent is 100 that's as high as it goes some of these others 88 he's not bad 72 getting lower and lower 58 so you can uh, this is what I'm kind of basing on what I get from now on I made a few mistakes um, when I started out getting this guy and this guy I'm not really happy with them at all but um, hey you live and learn and eventually eventually you know hope to have them all and then you can pick and choose uh, depending on situation but okay so now we've got down here it shows you what you need to get and now how do you get these click on there and it tells you exactly this one gold draw in 084 fight in heroes mode um, that refers to I'll show you that in just a moment 
gold draw, daily quest, diamond draw, blitz fairyland, diamond draw. Now, this doesn't mean that you have to have diamonds to get these things. One good thing about this game is they do give you a lot of free diamonds. Um, just completing quests and stuff like that, you do get a pretty good amount of diamonds. So you don't have to be a casher in this game. Um, it does help a little bit. There are some people already in this game that uh, <laughs> got a lot of shit. So yeah, some people just love to spend, spend, spend on anything they can play. Good for you guys. I don't have that kind of money. Um, yeah, I did cash a little bit, I'm not going to lie, I did a little bit, but uh, I don't have the money to be dumping into every game I play, so. Anyway, getting back to this, so it's, what it said there is these two, you have to use the diamond draw, and these two you use the gold draw. Um, but what you can do is, even if you just use the gold draw and keep getting more and more of these things, you can swap them and it's like five to one or six to one I don't know I'm not gonna do it but basically you can sit there trade these green ones for the blue ones blue ones for the purple ones purple ones for the orange ones so you can eventually get those big heroes just by using gold and being a completely free player or using the free diamonds that they give you um, for quests and stuff like that so once you have those things uh, it'll give you an option to summon you summon that it'll give you a level one hero with basic skills and stuff like that. Um, first thing you want to do that I recommend is going into your bag and using these things. You get a ton of these things. I haven't spent any diamonds and I've been using these every chance I get to upgrade my heroes. So go ahead and feel free to use these things all the time to upgrade your heroes. You're going to get a ton of them. Um, so the first thing I do when I get a new hero is I upgrade it to the max level. Then I go in and click all the gear that it has equipped um, and this is the part of this video that I really wanted to get into with you guys how to upgrade your heroes and how to get this gear and stuff like that um, I just got this hero and this is actually the hero that I did a recording on a few minutes ago but uh, stupid sound hopefully the sounds working this time so I don't have to do this a third time <laughs> anyway so you can see here um, if if I have this available and you get these things for just from doing dungeons you do also get them from doing your 084 spins your lucky draw um, if you have it already this will be green and say equip so you would click it and it would just equip it for you like I've got here already if you don't have it available you can click on it this one has to be synthed but if you just keep clicking on things here they'll tell you exactly where you have to get it okay that particular thing has to be synced from ten of these damn things so click on that and here it tells me exactly where I have to go and what I have to do to get these things um, you can blitz it uh, this is actually good this one came up uh, so I can explain this to you a bit better too these only become available once you've unlocked them obviously uh, this quadmire 9 I haven't reached that far yet I don't know how far along that is but I haven't reached it yet so I can't fight it can't blitz it or anything um, this one I did do a while ago this is actually one of the very first stages that you fight so this is pretty easy to unlock um, you can just go in and fight it and it will cost you the six stamina eight stamina whatever it is for this particular dungeon um, or once you get three stars on a dungeon it unlocks the blitz option for you and to blitz you need just the regular amount of stamina and you need a blitz ticket which this is one of the most in my opinion this is one of the most valuable things you can have to save yourself time if you're a cashier at all um, you can get these things from the shop like 200 of them for like 400 diamonds something like that um, these really save you so much time from having to sit there and enter every single dungeon every time you have stamina but this is what a blitz looks like this is how quick and simple this is boom done no wait no sit there waiting 30 seconds or whatever it's just instantly done get your rewards see I got one of these things another one of these things which I'm sure will come in handy for something else and that's it now I mean I need 10 of those and as you can see I'm out of stamina so I can't really fuss around with that too much right now but basically once I get 10 of those I synth that and I actually need to synth it twice and then I would need these so this tells me where to blitz for that or where to go for that and I've lost ruins already unlocked that and done that so I would be able to go fight that um, 
once all of these you have all these you would click synth and then this would turn into a, a button that says equip and you would just equip and then boom that would light up and then you go on to the next one and all those are synth ones so uh, let me try to find one that's not synth Yeah, as your heroes get higher level, it becomes more of a pain in the ass. Everything has to be synthed. Well, at your lower levels, this will just say... I don't know, it'll say something about where to find it or something like that. And you just click that, and it'll open up that same menu um, just showing this. So, uh, that's how you do the... Uh, once you have all six pieces of gear, you'll see... On this dude, I have all six pieces of gear. You click the upgrade button. Um, when you get heroes, they start out with a white border. And then once you upgrade them uh, once or twice, they turn green. And then another couple upgrades, and then they turn blue. And that's where you see dead man plus one. This is actually blue plus one. Um, and I can't do this right now. I'll show you why. But as you can see, uh, when you click upgrade, it says gears will be absorbed. That means all of this all of these gears here gone they just disappear so uh, you confirm but I've reached my max level for this upgrade and uh, unfortunately it doesn't tell you what level you need to be for the next upgrade I did suggest that to them um, in the test version of this game a few weeks ago but they don't really listen to me when I tell them what stuff to improve their game so hopefully they'll get their heads out their butt and make this game a little bit better this is still alpha mode uh, alpha version server um, beta will probably open in a few weeks I don't know why they call them alpha and beta when they open a beta it's really just their regular server opening um, alpha server is their test version of a server uh, just for normal players to play they did have a version before this that I was allowed to get on for a bit but um, it was I don't know I actually had less problems than this one has I think this server just has too many people that's why it's so hard to log in but if you want to play this game um, I'll put the link for it uh, in my comments below my video uh, advance yeah don't, don't let me forget that advance uh, to advance it will give you your dude another star here or something like that uh, and as you can see this is what you need to advance these purple things actually let me go to Wolfie because I kinda know where he's at you need 20 of these things and what this is is basically cards of him you need Wolfie shards if you will um, and it'll tell you redeem in tavern blah 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 you need 20 of his energy crystals and you can get these from a few different places your league shop um, chaos space shop you get these energy crystals just from doing different chaos space stuff I'll cover that in a different video but um, so you see here it says one and that will give me one of these energy crystals now this is another way to actually recruit these guys um, if you get 20 of these you can actually recruit Wolfie using 20 of these shards uh, well oh and wait no actually it says there are 10 so yeah you need 10 of these to recruit him um, 20 for the first upgrade and then it goes up to 50 or something I don't know but anyway this is what you need these energy crystals to, to do those um, advance the other thing to make sure that you're paying attention to is your skills try to keep your skills upgraded it does get pretty costly um, I've leveled a few times and not kept my skills up because I had to spend over 500,000 gold just to get Wolfie's skills upgraded but I'll slowly start hitting this again you can see they get pretty costly um, they start out really cheap but just get more and more and more expensive so it's tough gold doesn't come fast enough in this game um, but anyway so if you have any questions for me just message me on YouTube or find me on Facebook um, that's actually the best place to get answers from me because I do always have my Facebook open as you can see up here um, 
when I when you message me on YouTube, I get an email, and then I have to go try to find the message, and it becomes a little bit of a pain. But if you want to message me on YouTube, go ahead and just message me on YouTube. Um, I do try to answer all the questions on there for you guys. Uh, I do miss interacting with you guys, which is why I'm going to try to start getting back into recording. Um, for anyone that wants to know about Wartune, I'm done with Wartune. I have a lot of very good reasons for not playing Wartune. I'm not going back to it. It's been seven months, so guys, please get over it. I'm not going back to it. Um, League of Angels, I'm pretty much done with. Haven't been doing much on there for a few months now. Uh, but I'm hoping to start getting into recording this game and uh, give you guys tips and stuff like that as, as I figure them out myself. Game's only been out for a day, so give me a little bit of work. But if you have specific questions, just let me know and I'll try to figure it out for you or you know usually I know the answer already anyway but if not I try to figure it out for you thanks for joining